those fast drum and bass beats like Questlove or Jose from Incubus? Well, in this lesson, we're going to be doing just that. I'll take you step by step and show you how to take an ordinary beat and turn it into something like this. Probably the first thing that you're going to work at is getting consistent with the eighth notes in between the hi-hat hits. And a good way to work at this is to just alternate hands. It's the same thing as playing like that on the snare drum or like that on the hi-hat. But in this case, you're going to do it between the hi-hat and the snare drum. So the first thing that we're going to check out is what are these drum and bass beats? And in actuality, it's just funk or hip hop beats sped up twice as fast. And a great way to start is to just start out with a plain simple beat. Maybe add in some grace notes in between the eighth notes played on the hi-hat. And then after that, you just slowly speed it up. Kind of sounding like it, right? Well, let's try something. Let's take the snare hit on beat 4 and the bass drum hit on beat 1 and let's move them back a half a beat to the and of 4 and the and of 1 to give it that little drum and bass feel. a fill every four measures. And from there you pretty much have it. You can add in more bass drum hits or more snare hits on various beats. The one thing you should remember is to just stay relaxed. These beats are not as hard or complicated as they sound.